in spite of the enormity of their success. There were areas in which they were constantly striving and constantly felt unfulfilled and unfinished. Both Helena Rubinstein and Elizabeth Arden were, at their time, the only two women in America, or the world for that matter, to have their name above their company. And at one point, they were two of the wealthiest women in the world. Before Elizabeth Arden and Helena Rubinstein, it was actresses and prostitutes that wore makeup. And they took the idea into the mainstream. In the musical War Paint, we meet uh, Helena Rubinstein and Elizabeth Arden in the 1930s, and we follow them through into the 1960s. It's an original musical with these two titans of musical theater playing these two titans of industry. I couldn't imagine two better actors playing these parts. They come from two entirely different backgrounds, and yet their ideology is so similar. And that's something that might have fueled their competition and dislike for each other. It shows how drive and ambition juxtaposes itself with happiness. The fantastic challenge of this piece is how to tell a story about the two of them when it is purported that they never met. Even though they had salons around the corner from each other. And so we found all kinds of, I hope, inventive and surprising ways to bring these two remarkable women on stage concurrently that don't invalidate their actual history. So many elements to this story relate so much to today. They both gave women an opportunity to feel better about themselves in terms of their appearance, but also suggested that women needed to feel better about themselves. This is a story about progress and a story about women trying to get equality in a man's world. How much have things really changed? The costumes are extraordinary. The set is incredible, the lighting. It's visually as fulfilling and rich as the music and the lyrics and the book. Elizabeth Arden and Helena Rubinstein sacrificed everything to achieve success. Some people who have it all don't have what they most really want.